looking at the next page in this book that we have to do today and it's all making me all the stuff now um which <laughs> is gonna be all the hard stuff let's see what we've got next thing we've got to make is the coffee cup shaky this morning. Okay, so we need M8, M7, M6, M5. And the white wire for the straw. be hard to cut out. Do I keep? Holy crap. These are going to be real hard to cut out. Okay. I might have to get a, oh, I've got to cut that white strip out too. Oh God. <laughs> All right. This one's not going to be easy. I've showed you but plenty of times with my cutting I put the scissors on my fingers underneath the paper and that um, supports the scissors <laughs> I can't support them any other way At times I shouldn't try things like this, but sometimes you like this all day long, shake it like this, so you just have to try. Okay, breathe. I've got to cut this skinny little white line out. <laughs> Glasses are fogging up. I'm getting stressed already, and I've only just started. <laughs> Okay, fingers on, scissors on the fingers. Let's try this, arms in. And go real slow. So that each time you're pushing the scissors down, you're readjusting the paper each time. <laughs> this paper's shaky too. All right, cut that line. Everything's exciting when you get it done. It's an accomplishment. You go, yes, I did it. Okay, got that line. Let's get this line now and then I'll be able to hold the big bit and cut the rest straight off. Okay. Shakes calm. I don't want to. <laughs> if I jiggle, I'm going to cut this little strip in half. <sighs> don't bring the scissors down until you're in there. Got him. <laughs> I got it. Okay, that's that bit. And this bit will be easier than those little circles and cut around that coffee logo. I mean, I know it's do it yourself, but this uh, this is do it yourself to extremes. This pack. <laughs> that white strip I just read cut out was the white strip to go around the top of this coffee cup when I bend it in a circle and they could have just painted a white strip on there but no now it 
because this is a circle and I need it in the middle. Money. <laughs> Bringing the scissors down a little bit at a time and then trying to turn and bringing the scissors back up. Oh, I got it. I got it. I cut it sort of straight. <laughs> Holy crap. I don't know how much I'm going to do with you guys. This is too shaky. I don't think I'm going to accomplish anything today. This is what you do. You try it. If you're too shaky, you walk away. Come back later, try it again. It's only because I'm on live with you guys that I push myself when I'm like this. <sighs> Normally I'd walk away, come back later when I've calmed down a bit. Try it. I mean, you never can calm it completely. You never... I never stop shaking, so, but you can get times when you're not as shaky as this. Oh, I can't know how this last. <sighs> come on, come on, hands. We can do this, we can do this. Got it. Now these two, oh, look at these, I've got it. Can you see the little edges on this, the little four edges that I've got to cut around and then I have to glue them two together. I have to cut these two circles and glue them together for the base. And that little logo goes on the coffee cup. I don't know how much of this I'm gonna do. <laughs> Would anyone know if the coffee cup wasn't on there? <laughs> if I stuff it up, it's going in the bin. It's not going to go on. Holy crap. How do I get around these things? And you've got to keep them little tabs on because they're what's going to push into the cup and hold the, the lid in place. No. <laughs> I can't even try that at the moment. I might do that last. Maybe by then my, my hands would have calmed down a bit. Sometimes they do. Um, the longer I do things, the more I get into it and the more I can con not control my hands so much, but my shakes sort of work with me a bit. How the bloody oh Jesus Christ. Uh, it's gonna be like a a hexagon <laughs> circle. <laughs> Octagon. I'll probably have about seventeen sides actually. This hard one, I can do it. <laughs> Thank you, Teddy. Oh, I'm trying, I'm trying. They're too bloody little. I just can't even. I'm gonna oh, I'm just throw it away. <laughs> My hands are saying, just get rid of it. We don't want to do this. It's too hard. It's even too hard to bloody hold in my fingers. Arms in. We got this. We got this. I just can't even. Don't get me done. <laughs> I can't cut down the middle and cut that wide out. I really can't. The bottom might have to just be like that. A little bit of extra white around it. No one's going to know, will they? 
All right. <laughs> That's the bottom done as good as it's going to get. Now this top. Oh, good God. I just cut my tab off that I needed. Oh, I don't know what. <laughs> I'm just cutting around in it. Sorry. I can't do this. This is just too tiny. I think even non shakies would have trouble with this one. If anyone's doing this one, um, tell me, how did you just go with this coffee cup? <laughs> because it's not going to work for me. I'm just cutting around this and I'm just going to have to try and show it in the best I can. All right, I'll do. <laughs> it's completely just square. I haven't done, I can't do the tabs. This coffee logo, jeez. Just doing a circle around this. Come on, hands, come on, hands. Now, if you've only been watching on um, my TikTok lives, yesterday on the Facebook and TikTok live, I made the little blue chair here. That was really tough. I didn't think it'd be so tough, but because the legs were on angles, it was. But I got it. It took me a while, but I got it. And I told them on that live yesterday that I'll come on about 1 p.m. Um, for the next couple of days to finish this with you. So that's the time I come on today. It's 1 p.m. It's 20 past one here now in New South Wales. Now I've got to roll this into a cup, but it's got to be the right size that fits the lid and the bottom. You know, I really loved this thing now, I don't like it so much. <laughs> We're getting more and more technical. Oh, here we go. I think I got it. Just keep the fingers, all hands on deck, all fingers in there. We can do this, we can do this. By George, I think I've got it. But now I've got to let go because I haven't got my glue ready <laughs> <laughs> to glue the bloody thing in. Let's <laughs> get my glue ready. Thank God this glue is quick drying. If it wasn't, I would be in serious trouble. I would never be able to do any of this, but I can't use that glue thing. Like I've told you, I've got to use a little too big for the glue because that glue nozzle is too big. Come on, buddy. Don't know how. <laughs> Shit, I'm just squashing it. Go on. I don't know how tight it's got to be for the lid and the base to fit. 
properly. Let's just glue it and hope for the best. It doesn't fit. Like I said, I'll throw it in the bin. No one will know. <laughs> Except for us. There's bits coming out the top that shouldn't be. There's bits coming out the bottom that shouldn't be. Uh, I'm good. Do you think? Oh god, it's stuck to me. Oh. <laughs> Big sweet tooth. <laughs> ah. Let's just hope for the best, eh? Touch a glue on the side there so it sticks together. And I'm just going to put glue all over it. Don't flip over, don't flip over. Come on, coffee cup. <laughs> Come on, forget this. Oh, not my bloody glue. It dries so quick, but you've got to um, make sure you put enough on each time. Oh, that's a big blob. Don't tell me it's not going to fit that time. And the glue's real stringy too. <laughs> a little base on all right now the top oh good god how's that gonna fit in there it's square and you know i'm supposed to cut a hole in it and shove this little straw in too i have to cut this straw now these are the um the things you have to do even with that little um that little lamp I had to cut the bit of wood. Nothing comes in the right measurements. Coffee cup, you're bending. Come on, mate, stand up. <coughs> so I'll get that back. I need to put a hole in here for the straw to go through. How am I supposed to do that? stuff you'll never find it again. Uh, if I put this straw in here it might make it easier for me to put the lid in because I'm not going to be able to do it with my hands. <gasps> oh no! Where'd it go? Oh, 
nose just not big enough. I should have left the wire long and cut it once I had it through this piece of paper. It's just not working. <sighs> Come on. Hang on. Try, try again. Don't give up. We got this. We got this. <laughs> All right. Any suggestions? Because <laughs> this is a Shaky hands, get it in there. You got this, man. You got this. Yes, I did it. Cut it through the paper at least. I haven't broken the paper. Now, what I want you to do is burn the straw. That'll do. Now, that'll help me. Get it in there more, won't it? More easier. Oh, hang on. I'm supposed to do that rim around. No, no, I didn't. I was... Okay, buddy, we got this. We got this. right in there it's not even going to stick that's where it's staying all right I I really <laughs> cannot do anything about it now I'll try and put this strip around the top I love this glue but if I'd love it more if it wasn't so stringy I'm just going to try and roll it, see if that'll work. <laughs> it's not sticking, come on, stick, lift up. Oh, by George, I think I've got it. No, I haven't. <laughs> it's all I didn't stick the edges down, so I'm just cutting them off. I didn't have enough glue on either edges. Don't cut the cup. Ugh. Don't cut the cup. Good girl. Now look, I nearly, I nearly got it around the rim, sort of. <laughs> this coffee cup has been a disaster. Oh well, it's done. Let's just put the label on. And then we're done. Get in there. Just lay down. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, it went on. Get off. Bloody glue. Oh my God, come on. Now I got it. <laughs> it's 
stuck to my finger. I got it. Oh, good God, how hard was that? horrible. Whew. Let's put him down here with all the rest because we don't want to see him ever again. <laughs> I can't even stand him. <laughs> see, this miniature crap is horrible for us, but oh, I can't even stand him. <laughs> Get up! Ah! Uh... Oh, guys, this is what it's like with everyday tasks. There we go. Here's me little coffee cup. Now what's next? Uh, a pillow, but... I'll do the pillow. Uh, this is a pillow. Okay. Need some stuff in. And I need this cloth. See, you've got to measure everything. You've got to... You've got to cut everything. I'm, uh, even to make this pillow, I've got to stuff it. Um, get some stuff in. And then it, it's all glue, thank God, the pillows. I had to make the, um, the doona and the pillows for the, the bed. And I actually stuffed it up. I, it was supposed to be one big long doona that went that way. And I thought it was that way. So I cut the bottom off and made that into the pillow. <laughs> and didn't have to do another pillow, but... I had to cut the foam out for the mattress and cover the mattress as well. Now these little guys down here, I did some more of the um, the washi tape yesterday. So I've still got a few more of those to do, but that's getting a little strip and um, winding it around those wheels. And it's just all hands on deck, all fingers, trying to keep everything going and trying to keep it rolling. do it like that coffee cup sometimes it just doesn't come out right but no one expects it to come out perfect coming from our shaky hands oh come on buddy it's the last bit last cut and the materials moving one little string oh good god They want you to do edges and everything, but so I fold it in a bit. This glue's dying again. Let's just put it all on. Can't be just. So I've been doing this for a few days. I keep waiting for this glue to dry in the bottle, but it hasn't yet, thank goodness. Oh. <laughs> the 
glue strings are a pain in the butt. It's not like super glue, <laughs> although it dries like super glue. It's pretty cool, but I just need to stick my fingers together. <laughs> Thank God, because I have it everywhere. Um, all four edges. Okay, that'll do. All right, let's fold these in. Glue strings off everything. Now it's just grab it, bend it, wherever it goes, it leans. Don't <laughs> I can't be too fuzzy. Okay, got it. Sedge. Okay, got it. One last edge. Got it. <laughs> Gotta be quick. Okay, now I've got to glue these edges and then stuff it and glue the top down. It's gonna be a cute little pillow. Smaller than what it's supposed to be, I think, but <laughs> you get that. I gave end enough. Oh, buddy, you got this. Yes. Oh, look at that cute little pillow. Now let's stuff him. He won't need much because he's only little. just aren't working with me today, are they? I've got to shove all my stuff in here first before I close them up. Stuffing that's falling out, I'm cutting off. Ah, uh, there's a little pillow. It's not glued properly. Come on, glue. Come on, hands. Ah, uh, oh, cute. I don't know where he goes. It was supposed to look a lot more stuffed and padded than that, but. <laughs> we did it! <laughs> you ever experience stiffness with your tremors? No, not stiffness, just shakiness. Um, I try and keep myself stiff all the time with my tremors to try and hold them. That's why I have my hands in. If, <coughs> if I had my hands out here trying to do things, um, I couldn't do it. But when I have my hands in holding my body tight, um, that's when I have more control. It's um, all about the control we can, or trying to control the tremors, even though we can't. 
we tried it. I've got glue everywhere. Now the next one is making a storage box. And see these, these three beautiful pictures. I've got to cut them out, but then I have to roll them up just to put them in the storage box. So uh, this is the extent it goes to, like, <laughs> really? Roll those beautiful pictures up. So where's the storage box? That's this one. Excuse my sniffing. Okay. That's the way I've got to get through here. Okay. Alright, that's that bit. So at the moment it's all just the building all the pieces and soon I'm coming up to all the plants I have to cut these individual leaves out to make these plants and then more plants cut each individual leaf out um, cut some paper to make flowers oh, I don't want to turn the page oh, I don't want to get into that it's going to be real hard. All right, let's see this storage box. Should be right cutting this out because it's all straight edges just about. But I like getting all my, when I cut a bit, I like getting it out of the way so I can see what I'm up to. because I have to fold it all together and glue it. Oh, of course. And then this way and then do the other. If I didn't have my fingers under these scissors, I would have no chance. Um, the scissors, my fingers hold my scissors for me. Because if I was just out here trying to do it, um, no way. No way, I can't even get the scissors near. Even if I put my hands down on the table, I can't. So with my fingers out, then I feed the paper into the scissors. And that's the way I've found it can cut straight and um, but I still have to go very slow I can't go fast because if you go fast each jerk could move your scissors in a different direction <laughs> and your hand holding the paper is moving as well so you go slow just so that you know that the paper's still lined up. Nothing's moved. I see a normal, per normal person. I am normal. But a non-shaky person. I would have had this cut out half a minute ago by now. And you also don't need to cut off every single bit. You can just keep going round and round and round. I can't. It doesn't work for me. <laughs> now it's got little slits in this box for the handles and I'm supposed to cut them out too. And I'm 
glutton for punishment because I've already bought a stack more of these to do. Cut these out because these have got to be rolled up in there and I've got to fold the rest of that material to put in here too. But it says I've got to if this is 25 30. okay I'm just going to cut straight down here and they want this folded up and put in the box too just as a blanket or something I suppose just put some lines here so I know where I'm cutting cut them three out and I'll fold the box and put it all together. Can't even see me lying. <laughs> Okay, getting there now. Fold these corners. sides. I should um I should put my tripod that can go around my neck so you are only seeing my hands and you be doing it with me. <laughs> I might try that. Oh, 
side. It's getting enough glue on and then you're not putting too, and you're too much glue on so it's stringing everywhere. And we've got strings going everywhere. Okay, let's put that up. Oh shit. Got it! No, because it's not glued properly. <laughs> Bloody glue. And I didn't cut the handles out for the storage box because I can't do that. Got to fold the fabric up and put that in the box. I don't know why they just want a bit of fabric in there and make it look like a blanket or something. say to glue this so that it's not falling all over the place. Ah. Uh. That's cute. I had to roll these up. Ugh. Lucky I've got long nails, they help a lot. <laughs> My nails do a lot of it for me. going to be sort of squashed circles. No. I am. <laughs> Let's make it round. Alright, I did it. There's one little poster. Oh, there's a pain in the arms. There's some things to keep them. I should look. Positive things to keep it going. Thank you very much for giving me the positive thoughts. I, I've had a central tremor all my life, so um, it's only in the last 18 months I've started coming out of hiding and, and putting my story out there. And I've found ETs all around the world that I'm helping uh, to not feel alone with this condition and also showing them that you know, just because we shake it's not the end it doesn't have to be the end of our lives we can still do things we've just got to find a way that we can do them with our shaky hands um, and head and body <laughs> I have a full body tremor so I have from my head to my legs to 
in the room. Our emotions fuel our tremors though, so nervous, scared, happy, angry, sad, anything like that will make us shake a lot more too. Alright, up it got here. That's my second poster. One more. One more. What can I make with this? So I'm actually a fourth generation ET in my family. And um, all four of my children have it as well now. But they're not. I've had it all my life. They got it when they were in their teenage years. Um, they're all in their 20s now. The oldest is 30 this year. And there's still only slight um, in their hands. Theirs haven't progressed too much yet. But they will. They do progress, unfortunately. Okay, there's me three posters in my storage box. <sighs> <laughs> so guys today we made the coffee cup that was a big disaster but we got him we made him the lids nowhere near where it should be but we, we did it we did it and we made the little pillow and we made the little storage box that's so cute and those rolled up so um, what have we got for tomorrow? Tomorrow we've got to make slippers and the computer and then start on the plants. <laughs> Let's see how we go with that one, eh? Thank you very much. How much would you have left to do? Yes, my grandma, before she passed, she used to have terrible, terrible shakes and I always loved helping her. That's wonderful. Um, my grandkids, that's where I got the Shaky Nan name from. My uh, granddaughter calls me Shaky Nan because she doesn't like me brushing her hair. <laughs> I make a head shake as I've got the, the ponytail happening and the brush and I'm whacking her on the head with the brush. Um, so, yeah, but they, there's Bronte and Lucas, my grandkids, they're nearly seven next, in a couple of weeks, actually. And... Um, they they love it. They want to be known as Shaky Bronte and Shaky Lukey. They they can't wait to shake like Nen. But I want to find that cure before they do shake like Nen. Um, it's a hard way of life and we've got to find that cure soon. How much would you have left to do? So I've got the, the plants to do. Um, as I said before, all those plants. And then the walls, the door and then putting it all together. So putting it all together in the end. Um, yes, yeah, so only the walls, the floor to do, and the doors, and not much to do left. But remember, I've got some more waiting for us. <laughs> we could do these for 12 months. I've got so many of them, um, and I'm into it. It's hard, it's challenging, but why not challenge yourself? And when I look at it, I feel so proud that I actually did all that. And that's what it's all about. Love you all. Hi, Chris. Just came in to say I hope you have a wonderful night. Thank you very much. I'm in Australia now. I hope you have a wonderful day. Are you? Day over there now? Um, no, night. Where um, It's 2 p.m. here on Wednesday in Australia at the moment. So um, have a beautiful day, everyone. Take care. Don't let anyone bring you down. Keep a smile. And that's what it's all about. Um, and, you know, me, as I said, I've had a central tremor all my life, so I've learned how to have it. And my family and the neighbours that we grew up with, they gave me such a great sense of humour with it. And that's what you need with this. If um, I didn't have a sense of humour, I'd be crying every day, trying to do everything. But we've got to keep laughing. And I'm teaching other ETs around the world to actually laugh with this. Um, it'll always be the elephant in the room unless you break that and, and make everyone feel comfortable around you. Because while you're shaking like this and trying to drink 
eight. Of course, people are staring. Um, so make everyone else feel comfortable and then you'll feel more comfortable around them. Love you all. Take care. Have a great shaky day. And I will... It's Tuesday, 9.02 p.m. Yeah, that's when I normally come on my lives on Tuesdays and Fridays or Tuesday for me. It's Monday night, Thursday night for you at 2 p.m. So I'm coming on to the TikTok to do my lives on um, at 1 p.m. with you um, to build more of this stuff. My poor little coffee cup, I'm not happy with him. He looks so sad. He looks so sad. <laughs> I did it. I got there. <sighs> we can't do it perfect as long as we can do it. All right, guys. Love you all. Take care. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, everyone. Oh, in Greece. Hi. How are you? <laughs> Is it? I just call you Miss Dimples or Mr. Dimples. And in New Zealand... Maybe add a bigger bit of sparkles to what to my little coffee cup. <laughs> At least I can pick him up by the straw. I've stuck the straw in there good, so that's how I'm gonna have to hold him. But uh, alright guys, see you tomorrow. Bye. Oh, trying to stop this button. <laughs>